forces on my side Heaven and earth have finally aligned Days are good And that's the way it should be <laughs> We met in class kind of. My friend Kirsty. She was my roommate. So she was like, you should go out with Austin. And I was like, I don't know. Like, he doesn't seem like my type. She was like, well, I'll just try it. I was like, okay. So we went out on a date. and Well, actually, we didn't even go on a date. We just hung out. And it went pretty good. So then we just kept hanging out. best the part is that she said, Dude, you could hang out with him for a few weeks. And then now we're going to be hanging out every week of the year for the rest of our lives. Start us on my pillowcase. It's like a moonbeam brushed across my face. Nights are good, and that's the way it should be. At first, I didn't really think he was my type, and I remember I was even talking on the phone to mom, and mom was like, Well, what's this Austin guy like? And I was like, He's nothing like I've ever dated before. And she was like, well, usually that's the type you marry. I was like, I don't know, Mom. And she was right. Uh, my first impression of Sarah would be that she was absolutely gorgeous. Definitely uh, one of the most attractive girls I'd ever seen before in my life. And for the first year or so, while we had a class before we even talked, I always told uh, Kirstie that she was just the hot girl that sat beside of her and it was just funny how it all worked out. You make me sing la 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 You make a girl go I'm in love um, I'd say my favorite physical feature is his smile. And not physical, I'd say how responsible he is. He's very responsible. So basically, we'll have our bills paid on time all the time. Yeah, if we even had bills, because <laughs> he won't let me spend money. Um, <laughs> my favorite feature is, I believe it's got to be her butt. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's everybody's. Uh, but uh, outside from a physical feature, I'd say her best feature is how caring and loving she is and she's always willing to do something for somebody else and she don't expect anything in return. Did you see that shooting star tonight? Were you dazzled by the same consolation? Did you and Jupiter conspire to get me? I think wow. you and the moon and <laughs> Neptune got it right Cause now I'm shining computer lab and he <laughs> found me and he asked for my number and then he texted me when he left and he said save my number I said okay he said I already saved yours as my future girlfriend and that was the very first time we like ever and I see colors in a different way you make what doesn't matter fade to gray Life is good, and that's the way it should be. And, uh, I had Kelly really organize a lot of it and be uh, part of it because I knew that I could get Sarah to the park with her and her not be very suspicious. Me and Kelly was on our way home from vacation, and she said, what are you doing tomorrow? I said, well, I'm supposed to go out to dinner with Austin. And she said, okay, well... Uh, what time are you doing that? I said, he said he'd pick me up at 7. And she said, okay. And she said, well, do you want to go to the park with me and uh, Cameron and Braylon tomorrow? And you can bring your nephews. And I said, okay, well, I could probably do that. So we went and we played on the playground and then was feeding the ducks. And Carson took off sprinting. And Kelly went chasing him. She was like, Carson, come back here. Well, the next thing I know, I look over and I see Austin hovered over <laughs> I was like, why is Austin here? And Kelly's like, he's not here. I, I ran over there to propose to her on the bridge and be like, come over, I gotta tell you something. And we had to be on the bridge because Mandy and Brian was across the 
pond taking pictures. And when we did, she was so burnt. She was like, we, no, I got to get out of the sun. This is stinging me. And I was like, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. And and then I, I told her that I asked her parents something a few weeks ago that she didn't know about. And then I just got down on one knee and proposed to her. And everything went good because she said yes. <laughs> So, um, after, like, he asked me, and I said yes, like, he pointed across, and my sister and my whole family was over there, and then my mom and dad and his uncle was, like, way behind us, and, like, so they'd all seen it, and then in the shelter house, they had, like, a little dinner for Did it. you see that shooting starting out? Hopefully that Sarah cooks every day like her mom cooks for me. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> no. I would say being able to come home, see each other every day, not having to go nights without nice. each other. It would be nice to just have like somewhere that's like just for us. And I get lost in